Holiday ads are everywhere. So to get notice, try earned media. That's the kind of media that you don't pay for. It's a great and credible way for you and your brand to get noticed. My number one tip for securing more holiday coverage is to start as early as you possibly can. And I mean really early. If you can start in the spring, it's a great idea to get all of your materials together and get your pitches out in June in time for all the long lead books which get pulled together, usually around July. Then in the fall, you can move your attentions over to the digital outlets, the dailies, the local, and by the time winter rolls around, you should have some really great holiday coverage lined up. So obviously brands are always looking for ways to work with journalists during the holidays. The key is for brands to be innovative, to, to have a unique product that we can sell. So what is different about your visit with Santa than your neighboring hotels? I personally am a travel journalist, which means that I'm always looking for packages, for deals, for hooks for my readers. So if you could provide that during the holidays, uh, you'd be doing well. At Shadow, we love to challenge our clients. But when they want to think about how to break through during the holiday season, the most important thing we tell them is to stay authentic to who they are as a brand. So whether that's how they engage consumers or the products that they offer, the most important thing is that authenticity. Because when they're not, media and consumers see right through it. Here's the thing about the news. It doesn't slow down, not even during the holidays. So instead of deciding to turn it down a bit with your PR efforts, I actually encourage you to do the opposite and, and double down on uh, your announcements if it makes sense. Your pitch still has to be smart, brief, and the news has to be relevant, of course, keep those things key. But while everyone else is slowing down, you can still handle it, the news and give it to a reporter that still has to deliver it. Get creative. Over the holidays, newsrooms get lots and lots of press releases and a lot of people want to grab coverage. So think of some different ways to get noticed. So for example, if you're a financial expert, offer yourself to be the expert in budgeting for the holiday shopping or setting yourself up for the new year and getting your budget back on track. If you're a childcare provider or a school, think about some tips that children and students can do over the holidays so that they don't get the brain drain. Email blasts are a thing of the past. It's so important to do your due diligence to find the right media contact for your brand and product to make sure it's relevant to their coverage beat and audience. I think the best way to get your client's press coverage is by keeping in touch with your editor contacts. That Rolodex will mean the world to you in the end. And with the landscape vastly changing, it is key. If pitching via email, put 2019 holiday gift guide product sample in the subject line. Keep pitch brief and identify differentiators that make your product stand out. Follow the same steps for pitching holiday gift guide ideas for year-end top 10 pitches, because many outlets do top 10 products at the same time as they do their gift guide stories. Make sure your clients sell their products on Amazon beyond their own websites, because many influencers and bloggers like to use affiliate codes in their stories. If you're not on Amazon, provide an affiliate code for your own site. 